so guilty of replaying moments in my head and wondering what I should have done or said. But that one was perfect with your hand resting on my back to calm my trembling breath before I walked away and swore that I'd forget. Could not forget another beautiful beginning to the first day of the rest of our lives. Hi, hey, I'm vlogging here. I'll lose the battery. It's okay. on. It's on. Okay, guys. Hi. We are doing a little mission with Zeke. Okay. We are having two toys. We're trying to get to our room. Back to here. Back to our room. Back to our room. And Zeke is trying to get us while we do it. So it's kind of a mission. So it's really hard. So that's what we're doing. Yep. You better see it on the video because it's really awesome. It's gonna, it's gonna have some music to it. Okay. It's gonna be have, it's gonna have. This girl is on fire. Um, music. No, it's not. It's we're not gonna have any music. It's gonna be regular. Goodbye, Maker Studios NYC. We appreciate all your hospitality. So we're off today. We stayed here for a couple days. It was beautiful. I watched the sunrise today. It was gorgeous. I loved it. So now we're headed to go to John Green's. Tim Deegan's tweet. You guys, hold on. Tim Deegan's hate telling me. Anyways, we're leaving the Maker Apartment. Bye, Maker Apartment. Oh, last thing. Somebody at the gathering or the concert gave us this. They drew this picture of Taylor Swift and Princess Tart and Baby Tart. I'm gonna leave it here because every time I come back here, it'll remind me because I am coming back here in like five days. So I'm just gonna leave it on the fridge. Maker Studios has this apartment just if any time there's ever a YouTuber or people we're doing business with come into town, they can stay here. So it's like a place that we just keep just for anybody who's in New York because hotels are really expensive here. So we just have this place so people can stay here. So I think it'll be funny if people come in to stay here, they're gonna see this random picture on the fridge and be like, what's this all about? It's my daughters and Taylor Swifty. What do you think we should get Gator Rager for his birthday this week? Um, birthday. Hmm? Birthday. Oh, look it. Oh, that's cool, huh? <laughs> <laughs> this is really hard taking him through the toy wow. aisle, knowing that it's not for him, huh? It's that's for Gage. How old Gage is Gage gonna be? Gage is gonna be five years oh, old. Oh, look it, Hulk. Yeah, that's Hulk. Oh, look it, Hulk. Oh, I love you. Oh, look it. What do you think he'll want? A Hulk! <laughs> oh a my goodness. Hulk. You're so cute. This is going to be really oh, difficult because we're only buying stuff for Gage for his birthday, but Rockhard really wants all of this stuff. Oh, Everything. Oh. Hopefully, this will be a good learning experience for him that we give and we don't just focus on getting all the time. Yeah, you got your spoons and then we'll get Gage a present, huh? Gage. Yep, these are his favorite spoons in the world. He loves these spoons and Zeke chewed up his last one. So we got him some new spoons, huh? Okay, just a minute. Well, we found what we're getting for Gager. One of them's for rock guard. I couldn't resist because I wanted to play with it too. Careful, don't pop him. Then we won't get to give anything to him. Actually, we did get him this. If you can see it. Got him an Iron Man toy and a big ball. That's a good birthday present. Iron Man toy. Yeah, who's that for? Who's it for? Iron Man toys. <coughs> who's it for? Whose birthday is it? Gager. Yeah, that's for Gage, huh? That's not yours. Okay, you got to sit down though so you don't fall out. Okay, sit down. I am man. So before we take off on our 10 hour, I think it's a 12 hour bus ride, van ride, we're gonna come and grab some juice from the juice bar. I like to consider oh, it. Oh, you said juice. Juice bar and the juice bars, oh. Bar. Okay, so Tim Deegan has attached a GoPro to the front of our van. And check this technology out. He has an app on his telephone that lets us see telephone. what the camera sees. What should I call it? I is it, if, uh, His rotary I, device. I, I heard it called just like a telephone. So that wow. is the footage that is being recorded right now on the front of the mini. Uh, this is not a minivan. That's what I drive it's at home with my van. kids. This is a giant van. Extra van. And now we're going to get a time lapse yeah. through New York City. It's going to be beautiful. From here all the way to Indianapolis. Okay, it's that time in every puppy's life where he's got to go get shots. Zeke, are you excited? No, he's not excited. He's excited because he's out of the car, but he's not excited for about what's to happen, right? So you just sat in the car to come to something even more, something that you <laughs> Zeke does not like driving. He whines the entire time we're in the car. Someday he'll probably learn to like it, but right now he hates it. That is a cool motorbike. Bicycle. BRP. Burp. 
Look at that thing. It's it looks like a comfortable. It's snowmobile on wheels. Yeah, dude. It's like a snowmobile slash four-wheeler. Oh, dude, Mike. Slash stormtrooper. My camera's tripping, man. Straight, tri straight tripping, dude. It's like drunk. As I turn the camera, it like is trying to catch up with itself. Really? Yeah, I'm trying to use the flip again. I don't know if it's going to work. It's magical. We're in nowhere. We don't know where we are. Pennsylvania, right outside of Pittsburgh. Getting a Cracker Barrel. We're going to get some buttermilk. We want some buttermilk biscuits. Get some butter, some honey. We're going to have some bu 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 buttermilk biscuits. Hey, Zeke, Zeke, Zeke. Oh, where are we at? Where are we at? Where are we doing? Where are we doing? What'd you find? There's so many smells, so many sights, so many chirping things and stuff. Yeah, there's been a lot of dogs in here, huh? Oh, where are they? Where are they? Give me that dog to play with. <laughs> Look how big he is. I wonder if they'll weigh, weigh him today. Uh, 50 pounds. 50 pounds? 50 pounds? Oh, Zeke. We've been waiting for about 20 minutes for the doctor. It's not very much fun when you're here with a dog who's very anxious. He's like this. What's going on? What's going on? Where are we at? Where are we? What are we doing? Why did you bring me here? He doesn't really like it. But he's 50 pounds, guys. He's huge already. Crapples. I think that's even more than baby tart. I think it is too. He's super heavy. And, and so I think we're going to start training. I think we're going to start puppy training him. Well, I have been training him at home, but like official training classes. I think we should do that. What do you guys think? What do you I think, think Sundar? What do you, what is, what? I'm really bored, so I made a paper airplane out of this. Out of a gum wrapper? Oh, good. They're here. Mm, we're still here. We're still here. Attack of the Zeke Altard. So we're a little bit behind on Zeke's shots, so he's getting three shots today. We're just waiting oh, for the doctor to come back in. Shots. But um, yeah, he's 50 pounds. I think that's crazy. He's heavy. I already said that. That's what happens to my pregnant brain. I he's repeat like myself a thousand times. Whoa, dude, just 50 pounds, yo. Pounds, man. <laughs> dude, what are you doing? I don't know. Are you dead? Saying. Did Zeke kill you? Did you bite your jugular? Are you bleeding internally? Oh, I'm just gonna step on you, okay, dude? Hey. Oh. <laughs> oh, hugs. Brotherly love. Brotherly love. <laughs> He's totally hugging you. That's so I love cute. You, <laughs> Dog attack. Rawr. <laughs> Woo! Yeah, it's 2 a.m. We've been in the van all day. We just made a quick trip around the parking lot. Yeah, it felt good. Get your heart beating, huh, Corrado? Yeah. Oh, you're looking so handsome right now oh, at 2 in the morning. Thanks. Oh, I'm exhausted. I hear you, dog. I hear you. This is what happens when mom doesn't plan dinner and she waits too long to make dinner. Baby Tart is <laughs> having this hot dog bun with jelly. <laughs> I couldn't find any more bread. I couldn't find any more bread. And Princess Tart's eating cold leftover spaghetti in a cup. <laughs> <laughs> At least they can fend for themselves. It's one of those nights where I had this plan in my mind. I'm going to make my mom's beef stew. It sounds so good. I have all the ingredients. I've got them almost all cut up. And then we spent an extra half an hour at Zeke's appointment, which I wasn't planning on. And then I came home and I reread the recipe and realized it takes two 45-minute segments of simmering, not just one 45-minute segment. So I'm like, oh, we can't wait that long. So now I'm going through the kitchen trying to figure out what else I can make quickly. The kids have decided to fend for them. Themselves. What's the big deal? Who cares, right? We're so hungry and uh, we haven't even ate them. I know, you're so starving because your mother won't feed you. Hey, that is my new waffle maker. Don't touch it. I splurged. I got a waffle maker. I've been craving waffles. And I was like, you know what? I'm just going to, instead of spending all my money at IHOP, I'm going to get a waffle maker. Guess what? I have to do this because you're having a baby and I should treat you more better. Okay, stop with the bobblehead, okay? What is that real? You're doing this with your head. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No, you don't have the bobble head down. You gotta keep your shoulders still. Just move the head. No, no. She's got that. Watch, watch her do it. Kind of, but do it from side to side. Like that. There you go. See? We know it. You know what, how it comes? It comes with sass. When you got sass, you got the class. <laughs> nice try. I think it's a girl thing. We come with like separate joints in our necks just so we can do that. Plan B. This is our plan B, huh? Okay, you're stuck? Oh no. I guess we'll just have to leave you there. I guess I'll see you later. See you later. Oh, good job. You need some help? 
Lucky Dow. I love you, Rock Hard. Careful, don't fall. Oh, your foot's stuck. <laughs> should I help him or should I just let him figure it out? Seems to be doing all right. Good job, good job. This is our plan B. I caked. We're at Rubio's. Oh, hell. Mommy Tard. Oh, wait, did you say, oh, well? It's okay, right? Oh, hell, why not? Look, kids, I'm jumping on the bed for you. I miss you guys. I'll see you tomorrow. Oh.